Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is me Pratyush and in today's tutorial we will be creating a very simple GUI based web browser just using Python and it should be functional and stable even though. So let's start by planning our project. So by the end of this tutorial you will be able to create a very simple modern GUI based browser where you can surf internet and easily go forward and backward according to your need. Now we will be creating this using the custom TK Inter module. So let's start by installing them on our machine and setting up our environment. So first of all open up the code editor you want to use. Now let's create a new and python file and let's name it something like browser.py. Now let's open up our terminal and simply install two modules. You can type in pip install custom tk inter in order to install custom tk inter on your machine. So you can basically type in pip install tk html view in order to install the tk html view module which helps us in order to get the browser or to create the modern GUI based application. So with that being said, let's start coding. So first of all we will be kind of importing the tk inter, ttk and custom tk inter and tk html view. Now in the next step we will be initializing the main window screen for our application. We will set the window title and size. So in this piece of code as you can see we have a title over here and we have set the title to custom tk inter browser and the geometry to around 800 into 600. So let's try to define functions for navigating to the URL and going back to the previous page. So in this line of code first of all we will navigate through the URL. So we will be first of all getting the URL from the entry field using the get method and then we will be setting up that HTML using that get method so that it first shows loading icon over here or the loading in the HTML form. So in the navigate bar we need to add the label which we will be using that set URL method over here and we will be setting up the URL which we have got from the entry method. Now in order to go back to the previous page we will be using this go back method over here which we are defining over here. And this will use the navigate back method from the library of tkhtml view. So the navigate function gets the URL from the entry widget and loads it into the HTML label. The go back function attempts to navigate back to the previous page. So let's build the user interface. We will be creating an entry field for the URL, buttons for the navigation and an HTML label to display the web content. So first of all we will be using this ctgate entry method over here in order to enter the URL field. And we will be using the frame in order to create a frame within which we will be placing our buttons. So we will be creating another button using the ctk button method over here. Using the text back and over here. And we will be also creating a forward button. We will be creating it using the ctk button again. But in this case we will be adding the command as lambda. And we will be setting it to the navigate forward function over here. Now similarly we will be adding go button over here so that on clicking that go button it will automatically navigate to the place where we want. So this code basically sets up the URL entry at the top, a frame for the navigation buttons and the HTML label for displaying the web page. So in this line of code we are starting up the main event loop. And that's it, we have built a simple yet beautiful GUI browser using Python and custom TK Inter. Feel free to experiment with the additional feature like history, bookmarks or even other custom theme. If you found this video helpful then please consider subscribing, hit that like button below. I will meet you in another video, until then keep coding, goodbye.